Hey folks, Mike with TV Parts today. Uh, we've got a Samsung UN65TU8000F sitting here behind me. It's having some power cycling issues. Uh, it could be one of three things, your power supply, main board, or it could be a panel issue. Uh, we're just gonna swap out both of those boards and uh, see what's going on with it. As always, if you need to contact us to uh, order any parts, just give us a call at 1-800-203-7484 and let's get into it. And you're gonna see here in a minute, these LEDs are gonna come right up and then they're gonna cut off immediately. There we have it up and off. And that's what this particular unit keeps on doing. So what we're gonna do in this video is swap out a couple of these main boards and a couple of these power supplies uh, just to see if we can get it up and going. Hopefully we can. All right, we're gonna start with this main board here. Uh, we've just got a cable up top. We've got a ribbon cable down here on the side and across the bottom, we've got our speaker cable and then the uh, uh, power button cable that clips in right here. First thing we wanna do first is remove this speaker out of the way. It'll be easier to move these guys. So lift up on it. It's just a little blue uh, rubber plug on both sides. It comes up very easily. Just shift it back on this one right here. We're just gonna pinch it at the top and scooch it on out. That's removed. And now we can get this cord out of the way as well and just set this one off to the side. Uh, this one, pinch on the sides, pull it directly out. And there we go. And looks like we've got this ribbon cable here. Just flip up with your fingernail, shimmy that ribbon on out of there. And this guy up top, pinch it, pull out. And then we've got the little nub in here. What we're gonna wanna do, uh, like always with these screwless, just lift up and scooch it this direction. There we have our main board. I'm gonna sit this one off to the side. Here we've got our replacement main board ready to go. What you're gonna wanna do is just line up with these slots right here. Just kinda lay it flat and you can kind of see how they're gonna slide right into those little uh, uh, openings that are there. Get your cable out of the way. Make sure everything's good. And then just reconnect everything. There we have it connected. Next step, we're just gonna wanna turn this on. And hopefully this will get us up and going. There we have, it looks like it's still cycling. You can see the backlights come up and they just cut right back off. So it doesn't look like the main board's gonna be the issue. Um, so let's move on to the power supply. All right, uh, next stop here is gonna be the power supply. Uh, your part number on this one's gonna be on this sticker right here. This one in particular is a BN44-01055A. Uh, so whenever you go to order your part for this particular uh, power supply, always be sure that your part number is right here on your sticker. Um, order by this part number. So looks like another screwless uh, situation. We're just gonna pinch these two sides on this clip and scooch that on out. There we go. And then on this one, we're just gonna pinch down to release that latch and then lift up at the same time to get this nubbin uh, out of the way. So pinch it, lift up that nubbin and kind of scoot the board out. We've got the power supply removed. And now we've got our replacement power supply uh, as always, just check for your holes. That's where everything's gonna slide into and don't forget about your clip. So just line everything up, make sure it's all flat. And whenever you scooch it inside, 
everything should just fall right into place. There we go, yes. And what we're gonna wanna do is just reconnect this. And then we are going to reconnect the power and see what she's doing. Looks like the lights come up, staying on. Nope, looks like it's cycling through. Well, just for good measure, we're gonna go ahead and swap out one more time both of these boards, just on the off chance that uh, it is one of them. It's starting to look like a panel issue, but just to cover our bases, we're gonna swap them out one more time. Alrighty, so we have swapped out both the main board and power supply twice in this unit, and we are still having the power cycling issue. So I believe that these boards are all good to go. Unfortunately, the set's just bad. Uh, so at this point, we're just gonna remove these, these boards, add them to inventory, and that's all she wrote. Uh, pretty simple teardown exercise here. As always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. If you do subscribe to our channel, your first order will be qualified for 20% off. Thanks, and we'll see you next time. Thank you for watching another TV Parts Today repair video. If you have a question regarding your TV repair, post a comment and we will try to help. And don't forget, you can help us and stay up to date by subscribing, liking, and sharing our content. Also, check us out on Facebook for exclusive promo codes.